going on, DLH Nation? That's right, it's Aaron Morstead, Dumb Luck Hunter Outdoors. And yes, it's been a while since we've done a video, and we've just been busy with family and been busy with weather and all kinds of stuff going on here in Oklahoma. Um, but anyway, so just just been a while, and it's about that time to, to put in a new one. And so we are putting in food plots we're putting in feeders with protein pellets and stuff like that we're not hunting over them right now we're just getting all, all the deer fed up and fattened up turkeys and and everything really to be honest with you that'll eat the protein pellets and whatnot that we use but something i wanted to talk to you guys about today is minerals um mineral blocks and mineral substances and stuff guys Deer are like anything else, and turkeys are like anything else, guys. They need added additives and different sub substances, just like humans. We need, you know, we eat iodized salt because we need certain levels of iodine in our bodies, and because it helps with our blood and it helps with different things. Um, of course, everything in moderation. Um, now, the deal with that is, is with wild game and wild animals, guys they need the minerals as well now they find little areas out in the woods where there's just natural mineral deposits and they will tear those things up and they'll lick them up and stuff but if you can add to that if you can find mineral rocks and mineral blocks and liquids and i mean there are minerals of every kind out there guys and i'm sure some of them work i'm sure most of them do but there are two things that i found out that work really really good and they last a while so yeah you pay a little bit more up front but they do last quite a long time versus the liquids and stuff and one is trophy rock and those things are amazing okay and i will put footage on here um so hang on actually i'm gonna, I'm gonna show you guys something real quick so bear with me Stay tuned. And we're back. What did you think? Yeah, you see that deer hobbling? Yeah. Um, and I'll show you some footage after what I show you as far as using trophy rocks and stuff like that, guys. Those things work amazing. And that doe that you saw there, there were there. I had video footage of that doe being there for for probably three, four hours, literally three or four hours, just licking that mineral rock, that that trophy rock and literally pushing off other deer in order to get to the mineral rock and uh so i started doing some research and stuff i started seeing because man those trophy rocks they work great but they're expensive they're like 14 bucks 14 15 dollars for the for a 12 pound rock um yes they last a while but being a teacher and being a parent and having foster kids and stuff, guys, you got to cut corners when you can, but you don't want to cut corners to the point where it doesn't work. So I actually found, through just sheer dumb luck, sheer dumb luck, um, tractor supply. I don't know if you guys have tractor supplies where you're at, but here in Oklahoma, we have tractor supplies. And one of the things that tractor supply carries is their version of trophy rock and it's called Jurassic Rock. So come with me real quick and I'll show you what I'm talking about. Packaged just like a, just like a trophy rock, except for, it's got this pretty cool little emblem on it right there. It says Jurassic Rock. And you see the little turkey print and there's a deer print right next to it. But anyway, I started looking up, I started looking up all the different you know ingredients on it and everything and started looking into it and stuff and guys that thing is exactly like a trophy rock exactly like a trophy rock and so i stuck one out at my father-in-law's because i use my father-in-law's property as kind of as a, as a testing site and proving ground as uh 
as I like to call it. And so I try things there. And if it doesn't work there, then I don't take it to my other hunting areas. And if it works there, then I know it's going to work in my other areas and it's going to work really well. And something I found out is, well, check this footage out. Yep, that's right. The deer are going to it just like everything else. They like the, the mineral rock. They like that thing. They go to it like crazy. And uh, so, yeah. And the neat thing is, is I watched that doe from the previous footage that I showed you, the one that was limping real bad and licking on that thing. I got to watch her heal up and be perfectly fine. And the neat thing is, is how, do I, how did I know that that deer was who it was? Because if you look carefully in the picture, she's got a little nick in her butt little nick little, you know and i kind of wonder if that's not where she either got clipped by a car or she got her leg caught up in a in a in a barbed wire fence or you know or something like that and but that little little scar just a little scar on her on her back hind quarter and so that's kind of how i got to see her heal up and see and i even got footage of her and i'm, I'm gonna have to look for it because uh I got a new phone, obviously, and I lost some of the footage. It didn't carry over, like they said, even though you save it on the cloud and all that crap. Yeah, it's just crap. <laughs> but it just, but it didn't say. But she literally, in front of my camera, gave birth in front of my camera to a healthy fawn. And it was neat to see. It was awesome. It was a blessing to get to see that kind of stuff. But anyway. Hopefully you guys can can use this. Oh, and I was going to tell you those Jurassic rocks. You know the the trophy rock is like fourteen dollars, thirteen ninety nine, fourteen. Sometimes you'll find it for twelve, but for the most part, your fourteen to sixteen dollar range. These crazy trophy rock or these crazy Jurassic rocks at Tractor Supply at full at regular cost are like ten dollars. That's five bucks less, four or five dollars less than the trophy rock, and it's the same exact stuff, exact same exact minerals and everything. So they're picture perfect. They're and the deer come to it just like they did on there, and the turkeys and everything else. Um, but it's half. It's like five dollars less, four or five dollars less. Well, now right now they're trying to get rid of all their hunting gear, and that's part of hunting. I don't know why they consider it part of hunting because you can use that all year long. I think that'll mark down to like six bucks, six, seven dollars. So run over to Trophy, uh, Trophy, run over to Tractor Supply if you get a chance and go grab a couple of those things for, for six, seven dollars. Um, I know me, I've been scooping them up as soon as I get a little extra change here and there, and I've been buying them up as much as I can. That way I have them, and because they store the rocks, they're mineral rocks, you can store them anywhere. Okay, and so yeah, and as I need them, I pull one out, throw it out. So, anyway, hopefully that helps you out. Hopefully you guys understand. Minerals are very important for healing. It's very important for for uh, birth. You know, for for the the does that are that got the fawns right now. They're growing in them. It's it's almost March. Uh, we're in no, we're in April, dude. Where have I been? It's almost May. They start dropping at the end of May into June. They'll start dropping their do their fawns and that will be the perfect scenario guys that helps aid in getting them healed up it helps in growth that way they absorb mineral they absorb the food better they absorb all the nutrients and stuff from the food because of the minerals and so yeah it's a good thing and that's why you need them and plus it helps with like you see in the video it helps them heal from wounds and injuries and stuff and it also guys especially you tro you idiot trophy hunters no just kidding i'm teasing i'm i, I like to shoot it right next to um but the big bucks guys they become big bucks for a reason it's because they hit those mineral rocks and they get perfect and believe it or not the more minerals they got in their system the better the antlers are that's right the antlers grow they're symmetrical and they're strong and they hold on a lot longer and they're able and the nutrients are a lot better so they'll be a lot better off if you give it to them um so anyway if it comes to that or if it comes to doing that choosing between that and food plots i'd take the mineral rock every time because they get their nutrients by eating grass and all that stuff out there anyway so that, yeah so i'd go with the, the mineral rocks so anyway stay tuned see y'all next time that's right if you like what you see hit the big thumbs up 
and if you're not a subscriber and this is the first time you see it hit that subscribe button and hopefully you guys have any suggestions or comments or, or as long as they're clean constructive or destructive just send them in and let's let's have fun and let's get it going and we'll talk to you later boop